The Draper is really close to the Argyle Red Line station, which is super convenient because you can get just about anywhere in the city off of that. And then also there's a ton of great restaurants up here. There's music venues and everything is super, super walkable. So it makes this location really, really prime. This is one of my favorite parts of the living room and it's because they've really maximized the space really well here. So they've put this small skinny desk here behind the couch, which is perfect because you'll often see people put like a entryway table behind a couch, but putting it as a desk makes it super multifunctional. So they can put stuff on it, but you can also use it as a writing area or with your computer or whatever. With all of these apartments, they have these really amazing floor to ceiling windows, which give you such great views. And with that, you can see all the way out the windows, which is really nice. And you get all of this view and all the light, but at the same time, there are these floor to ceiling roller shades and these can come down all the way so you can have complete privacy whenever you want it at the same time. They have this really cool area rug down here, which is a really fun way to add like a pop of color or a pattern into your living room without committing to a huge art statement. It makes your area feel a lot more completed and sectioned off like you have a proper TV area, which is really nice because it's such an open floor plan. You're able to maximize the space, but you still have like a nice cozy little nook. And then I also love how they've used a trunk for their TV stand because you could use that trunk and store away all of your guest bedding and everything. So that way when you have a guest over, you have everything you need right here and you don't have to store anything in any other closets. It's all already in your living room. All right, so this is your kitchen and dining room area. And the first thing I wanna point out is this table. I love this table. It's very like modern and very bulky and I personally never would have thought to put it in this room, but it fits it so well because it is a big bold piece that really draws your eye into the area, but it's also so functional to have this big of a countertop space. Also above the countertop and your sink, you have this open shelving and I have fallen in love with open shelving. It's such a pretty way to store your plates and your dishes and everything and make it look really aesthetically pleasing. I've even done in my own apartment, I have all of my spices and stuff in Mason jars in your open shelves so it's a really cool way to incorporate aesthetic but also make it really functional in your apartment all the drawers in the kitchen are the soft closed drawers so you can't hear them at all I love that it just it gets me every time so these apartments as you can see it's not quite a full-size fridge but it is pretty dang close and it's the perfect size for two people living in a one-bedroom apartment you can put everything you need to in there and it has this great freezer that has these pull-out drawers, which is super convenient for organizing and maximizing your space inside of your freezer. So in the bedroom, as you can see, you can easily fit a queen bed in here, which is really nice. If this was my room, I personally would raise the bed up and put it on a lifted platform. And that way you can get about two feet of space underneath to use for storage. I find that super helpful for all the random things you have in your house, like golf clubs or suitcases. It's really easy to just store them away under a bed and forget about them. I also really like that they've added a rug in here. It adds just a nice color and a pattern in here because the room is primarily white and you can paint and put wallpaper on all of it. But this is a really easy way to just add some color and make it feel a little bit warmer. Also, the closet in this room is really spacious and well-designed. So you have the rod, but you also have shelving, so you can store things up above and hang everything. And there's also a space where it doesn't go all the way across. So if you wanted to add a dresser and put it away in your closet, you could do that too. So all of the apartments in the Draper have these stacked in unit washer dryers, which is super convenient. You don't have to take your clothes anywhere. You can do your laundry all right in your own apartment. But also because the ceilings are so high, there's actually space up here where I would put just like a pull out storage tub and you could store all of your laundry pods, dryer sheets, whatever you need up there. And then it's all in one cohesive place and you're making the most of all of your space. All right, in the bathroom, it's this really clean, white, minimalistic sort of vibe, which I really love with little accent touches, such as this gray on the cabinets and the brass fixtures, which I think are so pretty. But also they've made it so that way, even though it's a really small space, it feels a lot bigger because of how bright it is. And they've made the most of the storage in here as well. So there's this mirror and behind it, it's a huge medicine cabinet. So you can store a ton of your toiletries and things up there, which is really nice. But when it's closed, you have no idea. And it being that big open mirror makes the room feel a lot bigger too. Also, all the showers have these little storage baskets drilled into the shower, which is really nice because it makes it so you have a designated place to put your shampoo and conditioner and body wash and whatnot. So that way it's not just on the floor getting all mucky, it's raised up and it just makes everything look cleaner and put away. 
So I hope you guys loved seeing this apartment. I am absolutely obsessed with this building, but one of the best parts about being a Flats resident is I get to use the amenities at all of the buildings. So this particular one has a two-story gym. It has a rooftop pool and lounge, a movie theater, a tiki room. There's just so much going on here. So I can come up here and use all those same amenities whenever I want to as well, which is awesome. If you're interested in this building or any of the Flats buildings, definitely check out their website, flatslife.com. You'll be able to see all of the layouts, lots of photos of the buildings, and you'll be able to see what apartments are available and the specials they're running. If you liked this video tour and you wanna see more video tours of different buildings and apartments, definitely give this video a thumbs up, but also make sure you subscribe to Flats on YouTube and you'll be able to see all of the new content that we're making for you guys. Is that okay? Okay.